Hello and welcome to the program. In the news, on May 11th, a U.S. patent is awarded for the invention of the first automotive muffler to Milton Reeves and his brother, Marshall T. Reeves, of the Reeves Pulley Company of Columbus, Indiana. On August 21st, the Olds Motor Vehicle Company is founded in Lansing, Michigan by Ransom E. Olds. And now on to sports of the day. In Western Pennsylvania professional football, the Greensburg Athletic Association defeated the Latrobe Athletic Association in a sweeping victory of 6-0 to to win the championship. In baseball, in the National League, on June 29th, the Chicago Colts defeat the Louisville Colonels 36-7. to The record still stands today for the most runs by one team in a game. On July 18th, Cap Anson of the Chicago Colts collects his 3,000th career hit with a single off of Baltimore Orioles pitcher George Blackburn. On September 18th, Cy Young pitches the first no-hitter of his career as the Cleveland Spiders defeat the Cincinnati Reds 6-0. Boston Beaners outfielder Hugh Duffy hits 11 home runs. Baltimore Orioles right fielder Willie Keller led the National League in batting average .424 and hits 239. Doc McJames and Cy Seymour each threw 156 strikeouts. The Baltimore Orioles beat the Boston Beaners four games to one to win the Temple Cup. The Baltimore Orioles are the first team to win consecutively, but are the last team to win the Temple Cup as it is abandoned in 1898. And now on to field hockey. In a repeat of the 1895 Men's Irish Senior Cup Finals, Dublin University defeated Dundrum 3-1. In golf, Harold Hilton won the British Open. Joey Lloyd won the US Open. In Australian football, the Victorian Football League is formed with the initial clubs being Carlton, Collingwood, Essendon, Fitzroy, Gelong, Melbourne, St. Kilda, and South Melbourne. In the first year, Essendon won the first VFL Premiership. In Canadian football, Ottawa College defeated the Hamilton Tigers 14-10 to win the 1897 Dominion Championship. In home nations rugby, the series was not completed this year. And now on to the association football section. Oh. In England, at the FA Cup final, Aston Villa defeats Everton at Crystal Palace in London 3-2. In India, Dalhousie defeats the 31st Field Battalion 4-0. At the Scottish Cup, the Rangers defeat Dumbarton at Hampton Park 5-1 and the hearts of Midlothian win the Scottish Football League. And now on to the tennis section. Reginald Doherty defeats Harold Mahoney three games to zero to win the Wimbledon Men's Singles Championship. Blanche Bingley Hillard defeats Charlotte Cooper Sterry two games to one to win Wimbledon's Women's Singles Championship. Paul LeMay defeats Frankie Wardin two games to one to win the French Men's Singles Championship. Robert Wren defeats Wilberforce Eves three games to two to win the American Men's Singles Championship. Juliet Atkinson defeats Elizabeth Moore three games to two to win the American Women's Singles Championship. And George F. Whitney defeats Samuel Hardy three games to two to win the Pacific Coast Championship. And now on to the horse racing section. Galti Moore won the Derby. Manifesto has won the Grand National. The Oaks is won by Limassol. And Galti Moore also won the St. Ledger Stakes in the U.S. The Belmont Stakes are won by Scottish Chieftain. The Typhoon 2 wins the Kentucky Derby. And the Preakness Stakes is won by Paul Cavour. This completes the program. Please subscribe and comment if you'd like. Until next time, thank you for watching. Goodbye.